Um, so today you can see the computer's been brought out. I don't know if you can hear it in my voice, but check out what I just did. One second. Watch that. <laughs> That is so freaking cool. Okay, I just had to record my elation there. I'll be right back because I have to hook up the two other axes. All right, guys. So it's only been a minute, two minutes, but I have an X, I have a Y, I have Z. This is so freaking cool. It's all manual for now, but um, just to show the limits are working, I'm gonna go hit my Z limit real quick. You can see it right here. This is the Z limit switch. It's gonna smack into it and stop. Pow, all shut down. There's a slight challenge now. I hit the limit. I have to either tell Mach 3 to ignore the limit, which may work, but the limit is also the e-stop, so I may end up using another input for just e-stop. We'll see about that. So instead, what I have to do is actually disconnect the stepper, because right now it's in holding torque. So if I disconnect the stepper, I can move it off, and you saw the lights changed which uh, re-enables everything. That's not my favorite way of hitting the limits, but I'll figure that out. That's all software. Um, so yeah, I have a moving machine now. three axes in one. That's moving at about 50 inches per minute right now because I'm a chicken. And a little resonance there too, I think. I think. So freaking cool.